Hey, welcome back to Fit Survive channel. So a while back, I accepted a very challenging request, uh, basically to build a knife for a person who only has one hand. So the guy who uh, this is being made for uh, is a very avid Victorinox uh, collector, uh, you know, typical EDC guy who likes carrying knives, but he lost his one of his arms to bone cancer. And so most knives like the, uh, the original Victorinox requires two hands to open it. And so you have to hold it with your left hand access it with your right hand, and that goes for all four tools uh, in this electrician. So when we add the dragonfly blade, like I've done in this double dragon ox here, of course it makes the blades accessible with one hand. Uh, that's the whole point, or at least that's one of the points of adding a uh, dragonfly blade to a Swiss Army knife. And uh, I think it's cool adding in multiple blades. Uh, some people find it a bit redundant. Um, for me, I think it's kind of similar to a lot of different multi-tools. Like even my Leatherman has a serrated blade on this side and then a flat blade on this side. And so I think it's cool adding uh, the extra blades to it. Um, but with this one, the whole concept was to get it to where uh, this guy who lost his arm was able to carry and use a Swiss Army knife again. Now, of course, there are certain tools that we simply could not add, uh, like for example, the saw. There was no way for me to modify the saw to where it'd be accessible with one hand. Uh, you could fidget with it, um, but it's just asking for trouble, you know, trying to get it open with one hand. Uh, same thing with the, the scissors and so on. Um, it just simply, I couldn't make it accessible with one hand. And so this was what we went with, was the can, the bottle opener on this side. And you can see what we've done is we added these thumb studs. And so they stick out just past the scale, just a little bit there. And so you can access the can opener with your right thumb. And then flip it upside down and kind of like a spidey flick, access the bottle opener with your, um, basically your middle finger. And so I find it fairly simple to open it. Um, like I handed this to my wife and had her try. Um, and so she had difficulty accessing it with one hand. But again, she has long nails and uh, of course feminine hands. But I think any guy uh, shouldn't have any trouble accessing this. It's gonna be about like any pocket knife that has a thumb stud that you need to snag and then uh, get some leverage on it to open it. So it's not the most aesthetically pleasing. Um, I get that. But again, that's not the, that's not the point here. This is not uh, like a you know, it's not meant for aesthetics. It's meant to make it accessible. Uh, you see what I've did, done is basically just drilled it out and then cut some threads into there, threaded this uh, thumb stud in there. And so it uh, makes those both uh, fairly accessible with one hand. So for the rest of the tool, of course, we've added two dragonfly blades on opposite directions, which I think looks really cool myself. Kind of like an Uncle Henry on steroids there. Um, and so you have the, this is the Spyderco Dragonfly H2 serrated. Really nice blade. Uh, so we have that on this side here, accessible with your right hand. Just flip the knife upside down and then you have the plain dragonfly blade. Also again, accessible with one hand. And then if you want it to go, you know, all you know, ninja on somebody, you can open both up. No, I'm just kidding. So anyways, that's the whole point here with this blade, with this modification was to uh, make this accessible with one hand. So. What do you think about that? Having that on the back, you can see we had a cutout into the scale uh, to add that. I think to a certain degree, it, it you know has a really cool look to it. You know, kind of weird. Definitely, you know, not your stock knife here. Uh, so let me know what you guys think about doing that, adding the thumb studs. Um, you know, it might be something interesting to add. Um, you know, even for somebody who doesn't have a handicap. You know, it still is kind of handy to be able to access each of the tools with one hand. Let me know what you think about that and uh, what we think about the knife all together. If you like seeing two blades uh, in one knife, it's just three layers. And so I don't think it's very excessive. Still fits in your pocket. But anyways, let me know what you think and I'll see you in the next video.